ladies and gentlemen, that is White Sands, New Mexico. Right below us. We're about 25 miles away from where they set off the nuclear bomb. The very first nuclear bomb ever set off anywhere on this planet. try one more time to leave with the drone in hand and you can see the little alfalfa field behind it smells like alfalfa all right so we are going to call miss Robin yeehaw because we can Baby. Hey, can you hear me all right? I can hear you fine. How e about you? Excellent. I can hear you just fine as well. Good. How are you doing, honey? Oh, I'm doing all right. Good. Glad to be out of Midland, Texas. Yeah, it is always nice, isn't it? It is. I will admit. I woke How's up. How's the weather? Uh, it's cold, but clear. No. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty. Not too bad, baby. are going to check one thing real quick like so our steering feels crap ola crap ola I don't like it I don't like it and I don't want it let's see do I have a way a little compressor I did actually check my tire pressure it well, does feel sluggish Oh yeah, it is definitely losing pressure super fast now. <clears throat> that really does suck. We're like losing ground really bad. Okay, well that answers that. So we need to limp in to our local hardware store. And let's see where that is. So we are having to do a little roadside work. Not what I had in store for today. Not at all what I had in store for today. But look at that. never tried these plugs so we're gonna try it today so that screw is pretty well beat up not seeing it coming out in one regular chunk all right let's go ahead and lock this thing in gear So I'm guessing this tire is just, and I've had three freaking screws and nails lately. This is insane. It's getting ridiculous. This is getting way ridiculous. That sucks.
once again, I've never, I've never used one of these particular kits, so we're gonna give it a try. This is exactly the same as this other one. That thing left a pretty gnarly hole. So we're going to try and even it up a little. Move the object. <laughs> well, that's funny. Used a pair of pliers. Remove repair plug from backing material. And insert into eye of needle. Center. Difficulty. Maybe open it up slightly. Blah, blah, blah. Insert needle. With the repair plug into hole until plug is pushed approximately two thirds of the way. Pull the needle straight out without twisting. Straight out. Of excess. Cement. Cement may be good. We're going to find out. Alright. So it's supposed to just be right there. We're going to find out. We're going to find out how well this rigmarole works. Ooh. Now the cap actually had a little puncture dealy in there, but let's see. Okay. Come on, baby. Go in. Go in. That didn't quite go in all the way. I don't think that was quite two-thirds. Okay. That is either going to work or it is not going to work. <coughs> what it has to do, and has to be, is better than what it was. Well, we're gonna try and stab ourselves. Stab ourselves. So let's see how well that does. Uh oh, you know what? I think I lost my valve stem cap. It's not pretty, but we're going to see how well it works. Center stand was pretty nice to have today. Holding pressure. So far so good. We're going to test it out. Yeah, this curve before it was very mushy, now it's not mushy. <gasps> and there's my valve stem cover, what do you know? Alright. So here is the question I beg to ask. Should I instantly pull over at the next tire shop and get a new tire or should I go on with the tire plug? I'm quite okay with the tire plug. I don't want to ride for thousands and thousands of miles with an unbalanced tire, but for a short time 
I am so not going to worry about it. The moral of this story is, be prepared. I highly recommend keeping a small air compressor on board your motorcycle. And it's my experience that the cordless air compressors are fantastic, work well, and tend to have a built-in uh, digital gauge with them. And the downside with the plug-ins, I've noticed that they can blow the fuses on your accessory motorcycle port as that port was never intended to run something that pulls that much amperage. Unfortunately, I wasted a considerable amount of time having to go back into town to get the tire plugs and rubber cement as I had failed to refill my supply in my onboard toolkit. So make sure to do that ASAP.